Inasio Fernandez, hi and good evening and welcome to Saligaon. Good evening, friend. It's uh, a pleasure being here. I want to introduce you as my old student. <laughs> I'm, yeah. I'm old, not you. Uh, it was probably 15 or more years back yes. when you were studying journalism. So today, can you tell us about the new startup that you set up? Okay, the name of my startup is Creador Solutions, and the very word Creador means creative and creator. So we always wanted to go in the creative realm and we came out with two products. Uh, one is a Android app that is called Sobd. It's a Konkani audio Bible app. We will we'll talk about that separately because okay. that's a story in itself. Okay. But, but your writing, uh, okay. writing now. contest. All right. Novella is a, a platform for aspiring authors who can come and uh, publish their work in short story fiction. And we already have a good reader base, almost around 2,500 plus readers uh, who are subscribed to our uh, FB page. So if I understand this right, uh, Inasio, this is a startup which is working out of SIBA, the Center for Innovation and yes. Business Acceleration in Goa. Right. So we are a Goan based startup. Yes. And, and how did you get the idea that you want to have a startup Related to the world of literature, which is pretty rare, no? I am an avid reader myself and uh, books always was the love of my life, rather. So I, every time I travel, there is always a book in my hand. And so one such day, like when I was traveling, uh, I realized like, why not uh, I write something? I'm into blogging, but not that very much. But I also wanted to write something of my own. And... I thought of like, why not create a platform for people like me who are busy working and when they have a leisure time, they can write one story and we can get that published. And that's how the whole idea of novella kicked in. So, so you took your hobby and made it your profession and your work? Yes. So you all are the only startup dealing with uh, anything to do remotely, even with literature in SIBA? No. In SIBA? Uh, in SIBA, yes. And in India, there are... In India, we have competitions, well-established competitions rather. Like, but it is uh, okay. going by that saying, like, uh, Facebook was never the first uh, social media uh, uh, platform rather. Before that was Orkut, then came Facebook. So, as we never know, we might be the Facebook of uh, literary arts. To get down to the personal level, when we knew each other, hmm. student teacher, student mentor, whatever... <laughs> You were then a youngster, maybe in your teens, uh, bec wanting to become possibly a priest. But yes. then what, where has your journey taken you? To IT, to where? Uh, after leaving the seminary, I have uh, worked in the IT space as a database administrator. I have reached good, uh, had reached good uh, levels rather. I was uh, the senior database administrator when I left working. I was even a single point of contact for big clients like Siemens and uh, down the lane yes there was a craving the homecoming craving that I had like coming back to Goa starting something of my own and that's what brought me back to Goa so right now I'm doing something in technology something and I love as well great so, I mean what more could you ask for you, yeah. you as long as you enjoy your work it's not yeah. work as as someone put it it's not yes, work it's more passion but but when you talk about uh, creative writing no, what's the scene like in Goa in other states are people are youngsters getting more into it are you getting a good response yes uh, the response has been phenomenal we have just started in February and February 2018 18. wow yes. that's very new yeah, yeah I didn't right. realize you were just a few weeks old yes and we keep hearing so much about you <laughs> right and uh, first thing what we did, we threw up the competition called Launchpad. It's a launchpad for novella as well and for people to uh, launch themselves as authors. Okay. And we got over 100 stories of from uh, around 60 students. It was a phenomenal. Goa? In Goa, yes. So we had invited schools, colleges and all. It was phenomenal the response that we received. And our reader base kept on growing. It was uh, wow. in... In few days, we crossed 2,000 wow. likes on Facebook. So in itself, it is, we feel good about it. And we know we still have this, uh, we have to still reach beyond the sky. Which genre is more attractive? Short story, novel, poetry? 
I feel today, uh, going by uh, the social media addiction and the phone addiction, people do not want to venture into reading novels, big uh, novels. So they want to keep their reach short. And uh, if you go to say there are many content websites that have come that keep throwing content at you, uh, maybe like compilation of talk talk tweets or something uh, news that is happening around uh, political commentary maybe. Or it might even be a girl winking at, at you. So, uh, given uh, that, in, instead of all the, this junk being thrown at you, why not give a platform for creative writing, creative thinking? Do you believe that it's important for people to create and craft their own stories? Like all this time, very few stories, you know, people in Goa or smaller states, smaller regions don't have a chance to tell their own tales. Uh, Do you think it's important? It is very important. I'll uh, tell you by experience, we conducted few workshops and by the, when they came in for the workshop, all the participants, some of them were very reluctant uh, to even write their own stories or even ideate a story, build a storyboard, build their characters. So once we instructed them, like, this is how you could do it. Okay. It's, uh, when we told them, you don't have to be shy. It, it's okay. Your first draft might be a junk draft. But yeah, I'll tell you at the end of the workshop, beautiful stories came out and some of the stories uh, are already on our platform. You just have to unblock yourself and right. you know, stop the... Motivate, uh, our youngsters require motivation and Novella is there to provide that. What next? What next? Next, we are coming out uh, with a compilation of top 15 performing stories on our platform wow. and we'll compile that and the uh, the author will get paid for it because it is it will be also an encouragement for the author saying that there's something printed in hard copy for right. uh, for for record for themselves it's already on website but they also have a uh, hard, uh, a book that they can say i have my story published in this book any question that i should have asked you but didn't you can uh, maybe about the uh, uh, upcoming workshops in sure, Panjim and Margaon. Tell us. Uh, we'll be having five day workshops uh, into creative writing, and uh, will it will be mentored by established authors, publishers, motivational speakers, uh, playwriters. Uh, it will be a good experience for you all to come and uh, explore yourselves and challenge yourselves into creative story writing. It, this is happening uh, in the uh, central library, Panjim, from April 16th to April 20th, 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. And uh, from 23rd April to 27th April 2018 in district library, Navelim in South Goa. Same timing, 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Thank you so yeah. much. And here's wishing you all the best. I, I think ideas like these are really badly needed and uh, you all are doing a very bold and in innovative job. All the best. Thank you very much, Claire.